G'day guys, welcome to Tempe TV. What a treat we have for you today. We've got former AFL superstar, Daniel Pearce. Hey, welcome, Pearce. Thanks for having me. No worries. Pearce, have a seat, mate. Into the hot seat. So what we do, we just go through a few quick questions. They're all quick fire questions. Perfect. First thing that comes to your mind, but before we get into the real stuff, let's start with a couple of uh, things. Where have you come from and why did you decide to uh, come to Tempe? Well, I firstly played for Oakley Chargers and then I was lucky enough to get drafted to the Western Bulldogs. Played there for four years and then uh, my time was up at, at the AFL level, so had a lot of high school mates and good mates that played down there at the Great Temples though, so uh, there was no other place for me. Fantastic, man. You sound I'm a bit nervous, mate, so just sit around. <laughs> Relax, <laughs> talk, take good, a deep breath. Good, good times here. here. Any nicknames the boys give you? You're new here. We just call you Piercy. Anything else? Piercy's been the stock standard That's one, it, but yeah. I have been known to be called uh, Zuko or Danny Zuko from, from my past. Danny Zuko, alrighty. Okay, Zooks. There's only one Zooks here, mate. <laughs> <laughs> and wife, partner, girlfriend? Uh, girlfriend. Fantastic. Yeah. How long? Two, almost two years. Beautiful. Is that getting the sort of watching one, one knee territory mode or? <laughs> Not for another couple of years. Oh, okay, and girlfriend's name? Letitia Atkinson. Oh, wow. Yeah, and she's a small Is that one. One name? Letitia Atkinson? No, Is that her last Letitia. name? Yeah. Um, let's go to the next one, Maddie. Oh, you know, Letitia, I know she watches at home, so how you going? We're into the real stuff now at home, uh, for those home viewers. Yep. If you could meet any celebrity in the world, who would it be? Oh, Just look, look I, love my, I love my surfing, so I'd have to say Kelly Slater. Yeah, very good. good. Nice one. If you could meet any historical figure out there, who would you like to meet? Historical figure. It's been a tough one, this question, for a few boys. So I'm mentally challenged, but I thought the street Oh, you know what? So. I'd, I'd meet Captain James Cook. Captain Cook? That's, mm. Yeah. That's not bad. Yeah, not a bad one. That's a good one. Yeah, not too bad. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> if you were a uh, woman for a day, what would you do? Make out of there, you know. Stop Mike answering the women question. <laughs> <laughs> the answer is the women question every time on this one. The women question. I know what I'll do, but yeah, quickest, quick, quick point, point, mate. Yeah, you've got to fire him out. Go try and lingerie. Right. Well, okay. <laughs> that's all right. Move on. Next question. What frustrates you the most? Could be about footy, could be uh, at home. Nah, dishes in the sink. You don't like that? Can't stand it. My roommates do it, and I hate it. You're a neat freak. Celebrity crush. Anyone out there that you. Jen Franson. Friends. Yeah. Straight off the bat. Off friends. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Very good. What scares you? What are you most afraid of? Spiders. Spiders are among us. Little red bats? Big nah, ones. big ones. I right. can handle little ones. I'll swat them. you a country bat. boy? Oh, I, I try to be. You're from Tempe. You're from the country. Anyways, next one. His girlfriend's from the country. Oh, uh, Letitia yeah. from the country. Yep. If you could commit any crime in the world and get away with it, what would it be? Rob a bank. Yeah, this one's too Three easy. from three. There, there it is. <laughs> Except for robbing a bank? Maybe stealing a Lamborghini or something? Yeah. And then keeping yeah. the car. We yeah. do have an office safe at the club, <laughs> so yeah. watch yourself, mate. Yeah. You could um, meet... Andrew from Jealous Craig will be worried with his car, <laughs> the car back on Porter. This one here, Letitia at home, she might have a bit of insight. What's your favourite pickup line that you've used in the, in the past, obviously? I've been using one in about two years. That's all right. Uh, Previous to that. Pickup line. Uh, what do you, what's your go to when you. Uh, did it hurt? So, <laughs> when, when you fell from heaven. Oh! <laughs> I had him going there. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Alrighty, Piercy, that's oh, a ripper. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. Now, yeah, we've got a couple of. Uh, a lot of people write in to us about uh, when people know that you're on the show. Mm. Uh, we've got a lot got of a viewers couple, tonight. A lot of public questions. So, the first one um, is it true? This comes from um, David in Brunswick East. Is it true that you love doing the junior clinics here because they ask if you autograph? <laughs> it's got to be a stitch up, doesn't it? I've done no. one and I haven't been asked for an autograph yet, so I don't That's know. That's a bit disappointing from the junior. Yeah, so maybe they need to pick it up a little bit. Cool. Has there any, uh... Yeah, I've got um, Ross from Doncaster says, what's it like playing to such a small crowd? Are you used to it? <laughs> well, back in the days with uh, the doggies, we weren't travelling too well when I first started, so we had a couple of... Uh, Small crowds at VFL, but then it picked up towards the end, to be honest. But um, no, it's it's nice. It's local, and you know, it's a homey environment. Beautiful. You finished off well there. Well, thanks for catching up, mate. Appreciate Thank you. your time. Thanks for having me, boys. Thanks, Chrissy.